Alrighty, thank you very much. Your full weather forecast brought to you by the Furniture Gallery. Make your house a home and shop for all your living room needs at the Furniture Gallery. The Furniture Gallery is a main family owned company with locations in Augusta, Bangor, Newport and Wyndham. Alrighty, here we go. Wave prices. Let's check in on those. Not bad right now at around three to four feet. These may get a little bit more active coming up later on today with the winds that we'll be picking up with gusts up to 15 to 25 miles per hour. At times, we'll be keeping an eye on that as well. Meanwhile, though, here we go. Water temperatures are still down in the 50s and even some 60s out there. So if you think about going to the ocean, especially today with the warmer temperatures, I would exercise some caution with that, though, with these water temperatures that are still cold in the 50s and 60s. But for now, though, we had showers that passed through earlier this morning. Those are now tracked off towards the east. We're catching a break. Then we'll have a few showers and even some thunderstorms possible during the afternoon period as we get some of that daytime heating going. But now with this energy moving away, we'll get a little bit developing this afternoon. We'll calm down tonight before more active weather begins to approach. Meanwhile, though, some more showers and storms developing across parts of the Midwestern states, at least at this time, tracking down toward the southern parts of the U.S. So future cast showing more development this afternoon with a few showers and storms possible. Later on tonight, increasing clouds will be the common idea. With more rain on the way by early Thursday morning, heavy downpours cannot be ruled out. Notice, though, by around 11 o'clock in the morning on Thursday, most of the rain is out of our viewing area. But a little bit more development could occur Thursday afternoon. They'll be scattered in nature, so we might notice that from time to time as as well through Thursday afternoon and the parts of Thursday evening before we get that out of here and Friday looking much better out there with a lot of sunshine to start things off. Meanwhile, let's talk about the rainfall basically between now and Thursday night, maybe early Friday morning and overall maybe thinking around a half inch to three quarters of an inch before we're all finished up. Locally higher amounts are possible, so be ready for that with this rain that will be moving through. Meanwhile, though, dew points. Let's talk about those real quick. Overall, not looking too terrible. Again, we're going to be out there today in the lower to middle 60s with the chances for rain. So it might feel a little bit more humid out there. We'll all get better as we head towards Thursday. Then by Saturday to Sunday, here we go again. Dew points back up in the lower 70s, maybe middle 70s in a few spots yet again. So be ready for that. So for today, partly cloudy, a few thunderstorms possible. Highs in the middle 80s, so a little bit warmer out there. Southwest wind getting up to around 25 miles per hour at times. Tonight, lower 60s showers and thunderstorms are likely. Heavy downpours could occur with the wind overall looking nice and calm. Tomorrow, here we go. More scattered showers and thunderstorms on the way. There will be dry hours as well with highs in the upper 70s and that west wind at around 5 to 10 miles per hour. All righty, let's check out your extended forecast brought to you by the Furniture Gallery. Lots of sunshine on Friday with highs in the mid 70s. We have lower 70s for your Saturday under a mostly cloudy sky. More showers and thunderstorms Sunday with highs in the low 80s.